Hi, boys and girls, how are you? Today I'm gonna to read you a story, one of my favorite stories. It's called Mouse Nest. Who writes the book, my friends? Yep, you're right, it's the author. And today the author is a lady and her name is Linnea. So I'm gonna read you, this is one of my favorite stories, I love it. So look at that mice. I don't like mice though. Do you like mice? I really, really don't like mice. <gasps> look at this. Hush, hush, a little mouse is sad, fat, sound asleep inside his house. Where does the mice, where do the mice live? Sometimes they live under your house. Sometimes they live out in the yard, in the forest. This little mouse though had a little bed and he lived underneath the house. On the stairs, the sound of feet. Look at the little mouse, he's watching as the dad and the mom and the little girl and the little boy go upstairs to sleep. And then he decides he's gonna get up to mischief. Mouse is up, it's time to eat. So he climbs up the counter. Look at this guy in the, in the uh, picture is brown, but this guy is white. Oh, look at him, he's climbing up on the counter in the kitchen. Uh-oh, crunch, crunch, he wants a cracker. Look down here, we have lots of food. We have crackers and the mouse is eating those crackers. He's eating bananas. Oh my goodness, look at this mess. Oh, munch, munch, a cookie snacker. Uh-oh, he opens up the cookies. Look at our cookies right here. We have the same Oreo cookies and these are my favorite cookies and they're the mouse's favorite cookies. Oh, look at him, he is a naughty mouse. Crackle sweep, he rakes cornflakes. Oh my goodness, he's using the fork and he's pretending the fork is his rake and he's raking up the cornflakes. And then he jumps into the pile he makes. He pretends that the cornflakes are leaves and he jumps in the leaves. He's such a silly mouse. Sniff, sniff, milk and cheese. Let's look down here, see if we have any milk and cheese. Oh, there's our milk. And let me see, there's a little piece of cheese. So our mouse goes over and he eats the cheese and he eats the milk. Mouse would like a taste of these. Look, he's, he's been using the, the, um, uh, the knife to cut the cheese. Uh-oh, splish, splash, the milk spills out. Food is scattered all about. Look at the mess he's making, oh my goodness. There's peanut butter and salt and milk and syrup, oh my goodness, he's making a terrible, terrible mess. Sticky gooey jam to spread, because I know jelly and jam is so sticky, with peanut butter smeared, look at my peanut butter, smeared on bread. So he's putting some peanut butter on bread and he's gonna enjoy a nice peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Who likes peanut butter and jelly? <gasps> Uh-oh, tipping, spilling, sugar falls. Poor and Pat make castle walls. So all the brown sugar fell down and now he's pretending he's at the beach and he's building sand castles with the sugar. Oh, olives, pickles, ketchup, fun. Pop the tops off one by one. So he's popping the tops off and he's making an even bigger sticky mess. Mouse steps up, he looks around. He can't believe the mess he's found. Look at this mess he made. Oh my goodness, you are a naughty, naughty mouse. Look, he tipped over the crackers. He tipped over the syrup. He smeared the peanut butter. Oh my goodness, what a naughty little mouse. Who made this awful mess, asked Mouse. These people need to clean their house. Did they, did the people in the house, did they really make the mess? No way, Jose. It was our little friend, the mouse. Look at this mess. Oh my goodness. What is he gonna do now? Do you think he has to clean it up? Let's see. Uh-oh, gurgle, bubble, water flows. Look, he turns on the tap and he stands on to pretend it's a shower. Soaks the jam between his toes. Oh my goodness, now he sits in the little teacup and he has a little bath, how about that? Oh my goodness, he's a silly old mouse. Now that mouse is clean and fed, he leaves the mess and he goes to bed. He's gonna go all the way over, he's gonna get into his little bed, 
cover himself up and he's going to go to sleep. There you go. Did you enjoy that? I did. Look at this mess that he made. Oh my goodness. Can you tell me if you think that these foods are healthy or not so healthy? Hmm, let's see. How about a banana? What do you think? You're right. That's a healthy snack. So if you're hungry, maybe you could have a banana. What about some peanut butter? That's actually another really healthy snack. So maybe you could eat some peanut butter if mom says it's okay. So we'll put that over here. Ooh, what are these? These are French fries. Are they good for you? No, not really. Sometimes it's okay to have them if mom says so. It's a special day, but you can't eat these every day because they're not so good for you. So let's put those over here. What about cookies? You think cookies are good for you? No, we all love cookies, but they're not so good for you. So you know what? Once in a while, they're good if you're, if you're having a treat, but we're gonna put that in the not so healthy pile. Oh, what about raisins? Do you think raisins are good for you? You know what, they're not bad. We could probably put those in the good pile. You could have those. Um, what about corn on the cob? I think they're good, that's good for you, right? So we could put that in the healthy section. What about celery? That's a vegetable, right? So maybe we could put that in the healthy section over here. So what do you think of apple juice? Do you think that's healthy? Well, again, you can have that sometimes, but how about we choose water instead of apple juice? Just because there's some sugar in apple juice and it'll, it'll make your teeth not so good, right? So we're gonna put that over here. How about bread? Well, you know what, you can have bread. You know what, you can have it on a sandwich. So we're gonna put that in the healthy section. What about a plum? Is that good for you? I love plums. Plums are really good for you, so we're gonna put that in the healthy section. Uh, what about chicken nuggets? You know what, chicken is really good for you, but this, these are nuggets, so they're not so good for you. So we're gonna put that over here. Um, what about milk? Do you think milk's good for you? Yeah, milk's good for you, so we can put that in the healthy pile. What about chocolate syrup? What do you think of that? Do you think that's healthy? Mm, not so much, but every once in a while, maybe you put some chocolate syrup on your ice cream, and as a little treat, you could do that. But we're gonna put it in the unhealthy pile. Um, what about Cheerios? Cheerios are good for you, right? They're a good cereal, so we're gonna put that in the healthy pile. And what about pancakes? They're not bad, right? They're, they're not bad, and maybe Dad makes them on Sunday morning, so we could put that in the healthy pile. What about, did we do raisins? I think we did. So you know what, guys? Always make good choices and choose the healthy snacks. Don't eat too many cookies or candy, because otherwise you'll have to go to the dentist a lot, right? And you'll have cavities. All right, boys and girls, hope you enjoyed our lesson. See you soon. Bye.